Hello everybody. Um, I just wanted to show you guys a little haul of what I found at the thrift store today. It was a really, really good day um, for thrifting. I found a ton of stuff. Um, I have them all little packages, all the little packages right here, all condensed, and I'm going to take stuff out one at a time. So this is the first thing that um, I have to show you. It's this awesome little Hello Kitty um, like rolling tote. It's definitely for a kid. It has a very short handle for sure. Um, I can't even reach the ground. Like I won't even reach the ground if I hold it at my arm's length. So I can't use it for this purpose, but um, I have a lot of displayed bags in my room. So I'm just going to be hanging it up anyways. Um, I did put some of my finds in here. Right off the top we have a Care Bear Cousin. Um, I don't have any of this particular cousin, the um, dog, and I was really excited to find this because I love the color scheme and design and I just think he's so adorable. I also found this awesome Share Bear with this interesting like swirl tie-dye design that I've actually never seen before, especially not in the wild or in any thrift stores. Um, and I apologize, they're mowing outside, but I'm on a time crunch. Um, I also found this. This is one of my favorite Care Bear plushes, um, and I kind of like that the eyes are a little mismatched. The embroidery is gorgeous. The um, little butt heart still has the words on it. Um, so adorable. Love so much. I also found, this is one of my more interesting finds, this knockoff Care Bear. Um, it looks handmade to me, um, so I assume someone handmade it. It has like the little knockoff butt heart right here, and it's... It's kind of creepy and kind of weird, but I, I kind of love it, and I feel like handmade toys deserve love too, and I wanted to give this grandma a home for sure. I think she's really awesome. And then the last thing in this bag is a Grumpy Bear. Grumpy Bear is my favorite Care Bear by far, and I actually don't have this plush of him, which is um, very surprising, especially since I then found it and didn't actually look for it specifically so I was really excited about this one so next is gonna be my Hello Kitty tin that I found I collect tins I have let me count one two three four five about five or six tins right now on display and um, I love this design I don't usually collect red I'm more of a pink person but I just love the design it's it's in perfect condition and inside I have some of the little things that I found so I found some Little Ponies, uh, they're they're pretty cute, but their hair is in really bad shape. Um, this one has red eyes, <laughs> kind of scary. Um, I did find this Lemon Drop. She's not in great shape, but she's very, very cool. I don't have her in my collection, so I'm really excited for her. Um, and then some more just little, this really pretty rarity sort of situation. So cute. Yeah, they're really pretty. I do like them. I'm excited for these like that more dynamic poses as well. I think they're like really interesting. And then this little adorable Hello Kitty like plastic container, like storage container with um, frozen toys inside, which is interesting and fun. Move this stuff over. I also found this amazing All My Heart Bear, which I have never seen before, and I was so excited to find it in the box. And it's in really good shape, so I'm really excited about this one, for sure. And then my last little bag is this Karop... Karopi... Don't, don't judge me. Bag. You know, the person cutting their lawn is actually getting closer as this video continues, which is like the worst possible case scenario. It's really starting to bother me a lot. And, um, yeah. I did find this My Melody as well. I thought she was super cute. I was... I love her little strawberry. She's very cute. I found a Swift Heart Rabbit. I just got my first one the other day, so I'm excited to have another one. I found this gorgeous lady with her hair intact. It has not been cut. I'm excited to try and restore her. I had her as a kid, so I'm very excited about her. And then there's some little tidbits. I found a ball that rattles, which is really cute, and um, some invitations for my next adult birthday party. <laughs> um, I hope you guys enjoyed seeing my haul now that it's a big pile on my bed. I am hoping to post another Pokemon sorting video soon 
And um, if you're interested in more hauls like this, just let me know. I post a lot of stuff like this on my Instagram, Care Kitty Collector. Um, on my stories are always full of hauls, and um, when I find them at the store, I usually record it. So uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed this, and um, I will talk to you later. Bye!